Right? Hey, Coach. Hey, Coach. When you look at getting that, that time in between the last game, what do you feel like you guys accomplished practice-wise or preparation-wise? Yeah, it's a tricky balance with this uh, five-day break, you know, of, uh, of trying to maintain rhythm but also take advantage of the time to, uh, to rest up, heal up bumps and bruises. So, um, you know, I feel like we achieved that, you know, in terms of, uh, you know, getting, getting enough work, but you know, keeping guys, uh, keeping guys rested. Is Eric good? Eric Gordon, good to go. Eric Gordon, you good to go. Yes. Oh, he had the migraine the last game. Okay. Yeah, he's good. Is everybody healthy? Everybody's too? available, yep. Just even, just even getting to the playoffs with that, uh, how, it's a sense of relief, uh, finally, how, how do you do with the health? It's a great player? starting point. Yeah. You know, I mean, you know, I won't be dealing with it, but, um, you know, when they occur, you know, every coach has to has to adjust when it happens. We've talked a lot about the tight shell against this team in particular. How do you like the way that you guys have been able to maintain that but also get out to shooters because they are a really good three-point shooting team and you've had success in them? Yeah, they're a great shooting team, and, uh, you know, we've been pretty good at it. And, you know, when they you know, when they drive and kick, we just got to make sure that we're, we're stopping the ball and getting back to shooters. I mean, it's a, it's a multiple effort type of thing. When you look at the perimeter defenders that they have, how important is it that Eric has been able to set those types of screens that really can free those guys up? Yeah, look, every every screen that is set you know, throughout our offense, whether it's small screen for bigs, big screen for smalls, you know that all uh, falls into uh, executing at a high level, you know, which you need to do during, during a uh, you know come playoff time. Playoff intensity increasing. What have you seen from the guys? Maybe just how their focus going in, and the level of dedication. Yeah, they're ready. Now. Yeah, they're ready. They've been extremely attentive in all of our film sessions, which have been, you know, with the with the week off, have been <laughs> very thorough. Um, but they're very attentive, very locked into uh, the plan, and you know the different ways the game can shift. You know, with, uh, with potential adjustments, and um, you know, we've kind of talked about all of it, and uh, and we'll, we'll be ready to you know for whatever they throw at us. Frank, you guys, coaches, keep notes, you know, throughout the course of the season. Do you have a special playoff? The book that you kept in, and how much could you've been in so many? How much do you reference from the past to a day to yeah. just all up here for the most part? And uh, you know, I reference things as as they come to me, as as the the next scenario plays out. You know, if I see something that reminds me of you know a, a, a play a Pacers Heat matchup and think some of the things they you know they, they did that came up this week. Something that I remember from. You know, the Heat series is, um, you know, that something comes up from some of the Lakers series is, you know, as we encounter certain scenarios, you know, all, all of that is in, uh, is, is in my head from uh, just from, you know, the experience bucket, you know what I mean? And uh, you use those experiences the best you can uh, to try to help this year group. Knowing that the journey really does start now, new season, is there much that needs to be said to the team or is it, do you kind of take more of a, I'm not going to say quiet approach, but in terms of getting this team focused and ready, how does that come? How does that work from your perspective? No, I mean we were very thorough and detailed in you know uh, preparing for for these games, uh, but also setting a tone for what the playoffs are about and what we're trying to accomplish here in terms of getting 16 wins. What is that tone? I keep that between me and my team. My team. You guys have gotten off to fast starts in all three of these games against Minnesota. How important is that going? Into a playoff series, I think this is the first time I've hosted a game one since like 20, 2002, I think. Yeah, it's important, but you know we have to be able to, you know, the ride the eb, eb, ebbs and flows of the game. You know, I mean they're going to be charged up and ready. There's going to be great excitement in this building, and um, you know hopefully we can hit first and uh, you know play play from uh, we know with the lead. Uh, but if they they jump out and uh, you know we got to absorb that punch. You know, so, I mean it's a 48 minute game and. Um, you gotta, you gotta win the, the totality of it. Thanks, Frank. Thanks, Appreciate it, Coach. Yeah, sure.